what are the structures updated by SAP in credit management. So as soon as you see this statement, the first word that strikes your fancy is the word structure. What is a structure? To understand structures, let's understand credit management from a different perspective. Take a credit limit, say 100,000, and say on January 1st, there is an order worth 20,000, and January 5th, there is another order worth 50,000. Now, at this point of placing this order, SAP has to understand that there has already been an order created on January 1st for a value of 20K. And this information is not available in the typical VBAC, VBAP tables, right? This is the header, this is the item, or any of the tables, this information is not available to SAP. So what does SAP do? SAP stores this data in a special set of tables called S. 066 that's the name of the table and that table is the open order value so as soon as an order is created if it's configured properly it'll go to this table and make an entry here so by the time the second order is created sap can refer to this table and see that there's been an order that has already been placed for a value of 20k so similarly if on jan 10th a delivery is created again for a value of 20k and on jan 18th another delivery for this order is created which is for a value of 50k now at this time during the delivery creation the system has to understand that there is $20,000 worth of goods that have already left the warehouse and that's not available in your delivery headers or delivery item tables right so where is this stored this is stored in another table called s067 and this table contains the open order sorry open delivery and billing values so how much has been delivered how much has been built these tables are sometimes also called structures because they are not typical transactional tables they are more or less like accumulation tables and traditionally they are called structures and the type of structures that we typically talk about are LIS structures which stands for logistics informational system or SIS which is a sales informational system now although these tables or structures have a different purpose altogether credit management rebates and functions like these use the LIS or SIS structures <clears throat> to accumulate values that spread across a time frame so the answer to this question, what are the structures updated by SAP in credit management is S066 and S067. Now you can as well go to SC16 and view the contents of this table.